Hi Aquarius, welcome to October 2022 general reading. Thanks for joining me. My name is Michelle and this is for Sun and Rising Signs. Leaving it completely open to spirit with the messages that come through for your general reading. So for my air sign Aquarius, let's see what comes in for you guys. For the month of October, what are the messages for Aquarius, please, Spirit? What are the messages for Aquarius? Okay, let's take a look. If at any time during the reading you're enjoying it or getting something out of it, please do me a favor and press that thumbs up button, guys. Thank you in advance. It really does help out my channel a great deal. So let's take a look here, Aquarius. I'm going to get some oracle cards starting with your energy. Not a gender-specific reading, so pay no attention to the gender depicted on the cards. Let's see, message for Aquarius, for the, your energy, for the month of October. What is the energy of Aquarius? Air sign Aquarius. We have she who battles justice a fierce commitment a fierce commitment to justice okay aquarius all right there's a little bit of a uh, well it feels like taking a, a warrior stance let's see what the supporting energy is here give us a an idea about what you're dealing with uh for my lovely aquarians seems a little bit uh, concerning well, anytime we have to go in with shields up or with our spears uh, held high into battle uh, uh, problem afoot so let's see what's going on supporting energy for Aquarius the hanged one okay this is uh, the twin tarot oracle and it has uh, all of the major arcana in it. it has a light energy and a dark energy for each of them and this is the dark side of the hanged man so there's a feeling of being uncomfortable. Uh, I get frustration by having to wait, frustrated by indecision. Um, there is also an energy of uncomfortable energy, uh, perhaps something that feels quite painful in the short term. Let's, let's see what is the, what's going on here for Aquarius for the month of October. Can you show me what this is for Aquarius, please? Apples, okay. To taste, one must swallow it whole and beneath the satin flame hides drowning waters. Bobbing for apples, well, I'm seeing that as something that I get temptation. A bite of the apple. A bite of having to wait for a bite of the apple okay waiting for your turn perhaps let's see something's making you feel impatient frustrated let's get your uh, familiar for the month Aquarius what is Aquarius's familiar for the month of October oh okay we've got uh, a feeling of being vulnerable here we've got the seal okay so you're feeling that something is, you're feeling vulnerable or you're feeling that something's, um, it could be, you may feel that something else is vulnerable, but uh, I'm picking it up as you. Okay, let's see where this goes. Aquarius, Seven of Pentacles. Yeah, it seems like you're having to wait for something, but you're thinking, gosh, this is frustrating. You're frustrated because it seems like things keep getting in the way. I get that. It's like one thing after another. You think you're almost there and you're like, oh, another obstacle, another hurdle. What the heck is this? Uh, I don't blame you here, Aquarius. You're getting frustrated. And we've got the Queen of Pentacles. Well, I feel you're looking for... Uh, I feel that you have your eye on a prize. Now, that could be anything. It could be a job, a person a place to live whatever it is it seems like you're waiting though you're having to wait for this waiting for the opportunity waiting for it to become free and we've got the six of wands yeah you really want to you want to achieve this goal uh, i get it the obstacle is the five of swords mm. well it seems like things keep getting in the way 
you know, you, you feel quite let down. I get You feel let down. You think, gosh, every time I get close to achieving this victory, something comes in here and grabs the apple away from me. I get somebody stealing your apples. Now, think of apples as whatever it is that you want. The person, the job, the house, the, the apartment, whatever it is, the, the money. Somebody else comes along, some other biatch here, and, and comes in and steals your apples. Frustration. The Seven of Cups. Yeah. Well, with this, what I'm getting there is... Um, There's something of an, okay, something's telling, all right, what you're seeing here, guys, what you're, what you're suspecting may not be the whole thing, may not be the whole truth, I'm getting that. Uh, you, okay, I feel like there's, um, there's something here that, that is an illusion. Oh, and you need to see it another way. Oh, okay. I feel like it, you feel like somebody is coming in to steal your apples, but I actually feel that that may not be the truth. It appears that way, but it may be an illusion. It's making you feel quite vulnerable because somebody's coming in to steal your apples, but I feel like there's, there's some kind of energy here that this may not be the reality of the situation. Let, let's continue on. We do have the Page of Wands. Yeah, you're feeling like, uh, well, I'm going to have to delay this now because somebody's come along and stolen my apples. Spirit says go in anyway because I think you're going to be surprised. I think that the, the, the apples are yours after all. Oh, okay. So if, if you've recently experienced some disappointment and thinking, oh, gosh, I really wanted whatever that thing is, and, but somebody seems to have come in and gotten in before me, like jumped in the line, you know, like a queue jumper. Somebody's jumped in there and, and seemingly grabbed what you wanted, like the last pack of uh, toilet paper on, on the shelf. But look back there, there's more. Look back there, there's more, there's more. So I feel like you will, you will be able to achieve this. So don't think that this person has it in the bag and, and that they've taken it off. I actually feel like... Um, they're not going to be able to achieve this. They're not going to be able to steal your apples. So go in anyway, try, uh, put, throw your hat in the ring, whatever you have to do, communicate. Don't hold back because um, I feel that you're in with a chance here. Um, but you're, feel, you're feeling vulnerable because you think that this other person may have it over you, but I actually don't feel that that's the case. Aquarius, now let's have a look. The King of Wands, yeah, I feel like you have to stand in your power here. And if this is what you want, you have to, I feel like you've got the edge over this other person, but you're thinking that you're not, that you don't have the edge, but you do have the edge, guys. But you have to be confident and go in and, and do this. Uh, feel the fear and, and do it anyway. This is, this is an ambitious energy. The Knight of Cups, yeah. So whatever it is that you want, you have to go in and, 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 and get it. You know, ask, ask the person out if it's about a person. Throw your hat in the ring. Make sure that you, you, people know that you want it. Uh, if it's a job, uh, if it's a house or something like that, make sure that you put in the best offer that you possibly can. Uh, and you will be surprised by the outcome because I feel like... Uh, you're thinking that this other person is has it, but they but they don't, guys. They don't. Five of Cups, yeah. It's something that you're feeling sad about. You think, oh gosh, I missed that opportunity. I didn't act fast enough, or somebody got in before me. But the answer is no. That's not actually how it appears. It. It, well, it is how it appears, my spirit guide is saying. It is how it appears, but it's not the reality of the situation. So if you can, if you can rise above how this is making you feel, it's making you feel vulnerable, 
then you'll be still be able to achieve this. I feel like the, the success is yours as long as you don't give up and walk away and just hand it to this person who's stealing your apples. This is a short-term energy. Uh, I feel like this, this person, Aquarius, uh, who's come in and stolen your apples has made you feel uncomfortable, but I feel like it's just a short-term energy. I feel like whatever this person did, I feel like it's like here and gone. They're, they're not in it for the long haul. This is just somebody... I don't know who this person is, but let's, let's actually get a card on this person. I get it as somebody here who... Um, the cloaked figure in the night that comes and steals what is yours. Aquarius, let's see. Eight of Swords. Yeah, I actually feel that that person is, is actually quite restricted. Um, they're not going to... I get them... I get them not being able to run off with the apple. Now, they're trying. They're trying, but I don't think they're going to be able to manage it, guys. And what you don't see is that this, this person is restricted. Uh, they may make it appear that they've, that they've got everything going for them and, and that they're going to get victory here, but the reality is quite different, guys. So the message for you, Aquarius, in October is not to give up. Keep your eyes on the prize. And uh, not only that, I feel you have to take action, guys, not just, not just sit back and wait. Uh, this is a time for action. I'm getting strong yang energy here. Male or female, it's time to step into your masculine power and take what is yours. Yeah, really. You know, she who battles. Um, don't let anyone take a, what, what is yours. This is a fierce commitment. This is justice. This is you making sure that nobody walks off and, um, and makes you with what you want and, and makes you feel like uh, you've been defeated here. Uh, you want the victory. So I get you wanting to, this is this person coming along here and, and trying their best to steal what you want. It's, it's just firing you up more. And this momentary uh, sadness here, this, this feeling, gosh, this has made me feel quite emotional. Uh, this makes me feel like I won't be able to achieve what I want. I thought I had the victory here, but now this has thrown me off. It's a short-term energy. It's a short-term energy. It won't be too long before you're back in the game, Aquarius, and battling for, for what you want, for what you feel is yours, rightfully yours, something that you've put, uh, that you've had your eye on for a long time here. Aquarius. So let's see. I'm going to pull a card from this deck. Message for Aquarius, please, for the month of October. Message. Okay, this has made you quite fearful. The energy here is fear. You think, gosh, this person's coming in. Are they going to take, are they going to get that opportunity? The answer is only if you let them. Only if you make it easy for them, Aquarius. Only if you make it easy for them. I'd say make it as hard as possible for that other person to, to get what, what you feel is yours uh, in whatever way you can manage it. Uh, really, that's what I'm sensing. Uh, you sense the oncoming storm. You think, gosh, this is going to be a problem. I didn't foresee this coming. I thought I had a clear path to success here and now this person has thrown, thrown me for uh, a loop. I get you being quite down about it, but only for a short time before you're able to pick yourself back up here and say, heck no, this person is not coming in and grabbing what, what's mine. Um, hell no. Hell no. I get, I get that. Uh, let's see. What is the outcome here if, if, you, if you don't give up and, and if you push forward to get, uh, to get this? I get you having the c competitive edge over this person. So let's see, Aquarius. What is the outcome if Aquarius doesn't give up with this situation? We've got courage and healing light. Yeah. Spirit wants you to go in, suit up in your suit of armor, and, and battle. 
because you you are of the light I get uh, I get that this is something I see you here I mean I'm looking at this figure of this this knight again male or female he's staring he or she is staring into the the woods here and on the woods are a, a little bit dark not not too dark there's nothing really to fear there on the other side is that sunshine on the other side is um, fulfillment whatever it is that goal is that you want it's just on the other side of this wood here but it's only a short distance away it's not even that far so i feel like um, while you may have to to battle for this I don't feel that the battle is going to last very long and I feel that you're going to win here guys but you have to have the courage to battle for it you know uh, to not step back here and, and just give it give it away give away the farm if you will uh, to this other person yeah I get you being able to restrict this person's movement but you have to you have to act with courage to restrict this other person's movement mm. Yeah, this thief in the night that's coming in here, Aquarius. But other than that, I, I see uh, I see good things for you. This this feels uh, like yes, you you're fearful that this is now vulnerable, uh, but in reality, I actually feel it's not as vulnerable as you think. I think you have the competitive edge here, Aquarius. Absolutely. I'm going to get advice for you. Let's take a look. Advice for Aquarius, please, for this reading. Message for Aquarius. Advice for Aquarius for this reading, please. We have, how does my body want to move today? Yeah, you have to move. My spirit guide is saying move, move, move. Change your state. Change this, you know, this hanged man, this uncomfortable position. Where you're feeling vulnerable you can change this but you have to move you have to move and this new this new movement will be a channel for more energy okay all right a new perspective yeah i feel like you're gonna, you're gonna although you're sad about this and you think gosh i've lost this opportunity I get you being able to shift your perspective here to like hell, like hell no, I'm not just going to give this up. So I get you actually battling and fighting for this, whereas initially you may be tempted just to lie in defeat and say, oh, oh I give up. No, I get, I get that that is uncomfortable. That's not sitting well with you. This uncomfortable position of just letting this other person run away with what you want run away with your apples oh no no that's too uncomfortable i feel that you're, you're going to make a move here to get yourself out of this comfortable position uncomfortable position and into a position of comfort uh, sustainability stability with this thing that you want okay but it's going to take you con conquering any fear that you have around having that competitive edge uh, Aquarius confidence confidence is and commitment to the task confidence and commitment to the task you've only got a short ways to go you're almost there this person's gonna come in and think that they've got you at beat you at the last minute oh hell no 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 Aquarius no uh, I see you saying no that that's not going to happen I just I almost had this I almost had it you can still have it guys you can still have this um, give it that last push give it that last push and you'll be able to manage this Aquarius I'm going to leave it there and wish you all the very best if you'd like a personal reading you can email me gypsyinsights at gmail.com or you can go to my Etsy store Gypsy Insights Tarot and purchase directly the link is in the box below I'm offering Skype readings in addition to my recorded readings, so please do check that out. Share me on your social media, especially if you know an Aquarius who you feel this will resonate with. If you are a newcomer, please do subscribe. I'd love to have you guys. Welcome. And of course, if you wouldn't mind pressing that thumbs up button, that like button before you go. Thank you guys. I wish you all the very best for the month of October. Thank you, Aquarius.